All right, sweetheart. We should probably stop here so no one sees us. You remember what happened at your last school? Don't worry, we'll be fine. Come on. Did you see Gordon's dumb haircut? <laughs> it looked like his dad cut it. <laughs> <laughs> what in the world? Oh. Have a good day, honey. Oh, I almost forgot. I'm not going to be able to pick you up after school, but Mike will, okay? That's a good part of having two dads. <laughs> See ya. What the heck was that? What do you mean? Why are two dudes walking you to school? Where's your mom? I was adopted. Those are my dads. What? Are you serious? She has two dads! <laughs> That's it for today. And please remember next week is bring your mom to school day. <laughs> is everything okay, Billy? What if you don't have a mom? That's fine. Just bring your dad. <laughs> what is so funny? Well, what if you have two dads? I'm sorry. Go ahead. Tell her, Jasmine. It's not a problem. You can bring them both. You must really suck. What do you mean? That you weren't good enough for your real mom. So she gave you away. Like, some used clothes. You don't know the story. Just go away. Or what? Are you going to tell your dad? Oh, oh, I mean, dad's on me? Nice try. Guys. Check it out. Jasmine's sitting by herself. Watch this. Hey, Jasmine, why are you sitting by yourself? First, her mom didn't want her. You know, no one in school does either. <laughs> hey, that's really mean. Yeah, don't speak to her that way. What? I'm just stating the facts. Hey, Jasmine, you can come and sit with us. Yeah, or over here. Thanks, but I'm okay. Yeah, she'll be all right. She's used to rejection. <laughs> Don't let him get to you. He's just a mean bully. Yeah, we'd love to have lunch with you. Thanks. Hey, I've got a question for you. I don't want to talk to you, Billy. No, 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 no. I'm serious. I promise I'm not going to be mean. Fine. What? Since both of your dads are gay, does that mean you're going to be gay too? <laughs> I told you earlier to leave me alone. Mom! Julia, it must really suck to see all these kids getting picked up by their real moms and dads. So, why did your mom leave? She just didn't love you, or what? Billy! Let's go! Okay, I'm coming! Mom! Hey, sweetie. Jasmine, what's wrong, honey? Let's just go. Jasmine! Tell me what's wrong. I don't want to talk about it. Come on, sweetheart. You know you can tell me anything. This kid I made school keeps making fun of me because I'm adopted. I'm so sorry, honey. Kids at school can be so mean. I just don't know why my mom gave me up like that. Do you think it's because she didn't love me? No, not at all. I promise you that that's not the case. Yeah, right. I just don't want to hurt my feelings. I wouldn't say something if it wasn't the truth. I know she loved you. Oh, yeah? How? Exactly. Let's just go. Look, we weren't going to show you this until you were older, but I think it's time you see it now. What is it? Just watch. Hi, Jasmine. You're so beautiful, baby girl. I've been waiting my whole pregnancy for this moment. Right now, you're mine. 100% mine. But this is our last hour together. And then, you'll be Mike and Harry's little girl. I know they're going to take care of you and love you so much. While I have you, 
There's a few things I want you to know. You're probably wondering why I decided to give you up. Please know it wasn't an easy decision. You see, my pregnancy with you wasn't an easy one. Okay, so who wants to read from chapter 32? Any volunteers? Maya's mom's outside waiting for her. Right. Today will be Maya's last day at school because, well, don't think I need to say. It's because she's pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Alex, it's because she's about to have her baby. You know, in school, you're supposed to be a kid, not be having one. Well, this wasn't exactly planned. Well, maybe if you had been more responsible, you wouldn't have... You know what? Never mind. You can leave now. So sad. I would be so embarrassed. She's not going to be able to take care of her baby. She's going to be a terrible mom. Even my own mom gave me a really hard time. What's wrong? All of the kids at school are laughing at me. Well, can you blame them? I mean, this is really irresponsible of you, you know. I didn't mean for this to happen, okay? Well, what exactly is your plan anyways? What do you mean? I'm going to keep her. Not in our house, you're not. But then where am I supposed to go? I don't care. That's not my problem. Clearly, you make your own decisions. So figure it out. But I don't have anywhere else to go. Go to your boyfriend's house then, or to the streets for all I care. Even her own mom doesn't want her. <laughs> Can we please just go? I don't want to be here. No. I need you to experience this so you can see what a huge mistake you've made. As a matter of fact, walk home. What? No, I can't walk that far. Mom! Mom! You better get used to it, young lady, because you're not going to be living with us for too long. What? But worst of all was what my boyfriend did to me. Hey, uh, I wasn't expecting you here. My mom basically just kicked me out of the house. What? Are you serious? Yeah. Whose heels are those? Those aren't mine. Uh... Hey, babe, what do you mean? Who's she? Who am I? Who are you? And why is she wearing your shirt? This is Stacy. Stacy, this is Maya. My ex-girlfriend. Ex? What are you talking about? Look, I was gonna tell you, okay? I'm seeing Stacy now. But we're gonna have a baby together. I don't know what you mean by we. I don't want anything to do with it. So that's it? You're just gonna break up with me like this? While I'm nine months pregnant? I was coming to you to see if I could move in because my mom just kicked me out. What do you want me to say? I'm not ready to have a kid. Maybe you should just, you know? Just what? Get rid of it. It'll make all of our lives a lot easier. What? How can you even say that? I'm just being honest. Now, if you don't mind, I was about to make some breakfast for Stacy and me. How can you do this to me? He said bye. Things got so bad that at one point, I even decided to give up on having you. Hi. You must be Maya. Yes. Is anyone joining you today? You know, like a mom or boyfriend, perhaps? No, it's just me. OK. Um, well, before we get started, I just want to confirm. Are you sure you want to do this? No, but I don't have any choice. What do you mean? My mom kicked me out. My boyfriend broke up with me. I have no money and nowhere to go. There's no way I could take care of a child all by myself. I see. This is none of my business, but have you considered adoption? I'm sure we could find your baby a really good home. Oh, wow. I guess I hadn't really thought about that. I think it's an incredible alternative 
especially for girls that are in your situation. Maybe I should think about it then. Thank you so much. You have no idea how much I appreciate this. You're welcome. And if you look right here, it explains how this all works and how you can help make a family happy with a child of their own. So you see, that's how I decided to give you up for adoption. It wasn't because I didn't love you. It's because I wanted to give you the best life possible. It's time. Okay, just one more second, please. The nurse just got here. So, I have to give you up now. But please know that one day I'm going to come and see you. Until then, I'll be thinking about you every day. I love you so much. <laughs> you see, I told you she loves you. <laughs> I want to introduce everyone to my dad's. Oh, that is so embarrassing. That's enough, Billy. It's okay, Miss Green. At least my dad's chose me. Your mom didn't have a choice. <laughs> As I was saying, these are my dads, and they are the best parents in the world. I won! You are so good at this game. Oh, would you mind getting that, sweetie? Sure. Hi, Jasmine. Wait, are you? She's your mom. We figured it was time you two met. Wow, you are more beautiful than I could have ever imagined. There hasn't been a day that's gone by where I haven't thought about you. I am so sorry I couldn't be there for you. It's okay. I'm just happy you're here. <laughs> We were playing Candyland. Do you want to join us? Sure, I'd love to. <laughs> Fair warning, we haven't won a single game against Jasmine. <laughs> yeah, she's really good. Nice. And don't think I'll go easy on you, either. <laughs> That's okay. I think I'm up for a challenge. <laughs> Guess he's here. Why we have to share a room? Just because Sabrina is adopted doesn't mean she isn't your sister. You're never gonna be a part of our family. You don't have to be related to be family. I'm your real daughter. She's just adopted. 